I've heard so many times about all the different sides. Which one will I be on? Which one will I hide behind? I'll be on the outside where the world opens wide. Check them out. Great books. Check them out. Ooh. Want to hear a poem? Oh, 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 oh. I bet you love to hear a poem. Oh, 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 do you want to hear a poem? Get out of here! You're a nobody! Rah! What do you mean? I'm not a nobody. I'm a poet. And even if I am a nobody, I'm not just going to be any nobody. <laughs> and you better watch out too. You know what they say? Nobody wins every time. When everyone is quiet and nervous about everything, in the heaviest silence, nobody gets up to sing. Everything is incomplete. No tasks run on and on. There's no way to our era. Nobody can get it all done. All our demands are different as we answer our own call. And in our diverse desires, nobody can please them all. And when all is thought lost and life's a desperate climb, no matter what the deficit, nobody can come from behind. Call this deluded help, call my logic a crime, but I know from experience. Nobody wins every time. And in our desperate hours of toiling endlessness, stretch it out for eternity. Nobody has time for this. You may weep for loss of youth, always wish things were better. You may dread growing old. Nobody lives forever. Life's a terminal illness, everyone is doomed. Nobody can survive. Nobody is immune. Some call them nobodies. Don't say you never hear it. But if someone is a nobody, then nobody's all spirit. And if nobody exists, with nobody to inflict, then I say this is a wonder. Nobody's perfect. A few years ago, I quit my job and began selling my books on the streets of Manhattan. For nearly 20 years, I tried to reach publishers and literary agents without any success. So I decided to go directly to the public. With whom else do I aspire to speak anyway? People often ask me doubtfully, oh, are these books self-published? <laughs> I never hesitate to respond. Yeah! Just like Walt Whitman, William Blake, Virginia Woolf, and countless others, I'm joining ranks with some of the greatest literary luminaries in the history of humanity. Self-realization is not a defect. It's a distinction. I'm like all comedians. With my little book stand, I'll move the world. <laughs> <laughs>